Flash flooding has also limited access to one hospital. Some ambulances have had to take detours to get to UPMC St. Margaret. Amy Wattis is live outside the hospital with the latest. Amy. Well, you know what? The water started to recede here on Freeport Road when that first round of rain came through. But then we saw that second round. This Pittsburgh police officer, he's been sitting here for hours blocking the stretch of Freeport Road. Let me show you some of the flooding here. You can see this huge puddle right in front of Waterworks Mall. It's actually taped off this entrance to get into the mall here. And then further down behind me, Freeport and then St. Margaret's Hospital is still blocked off the intersection there because you can see how there's so much water, a huge puddle sitting right in front of this entrance. So folks aren't going to be able to get through. Ambulances aren't able to get through this entrance right now, still at this hour. The rain came down in buckets, causing the roads surrounding UPMC St. Margaret Hospital to flood fast. Rhonda Ginther traveled two and a half hours from St. Mary's for an appointment at the hospital and had to park at Taco Bell because the entrance on Freeport Road was closed. That's the only way I know to get in. I ended up parking all the way behind Giant Eagle. Wendy Houston couldn't get to the parking garage or parking lot. She came to the hospital to visit a patient. I live up in Penn Hills area and Freeport Road was completely blocked. I ended up doing Fox Chapel and hit traffic on that road. It's just a mess everywhere. Other patients, visitors, and staff had to cross the street to get to the hospital. While ambulances and cars couldn't get to the Freeport entrance, a spokesperson with UPMC says the hospital remains fully staffed and operational, and the ER is open. The Delafield Road entrance was also shut down initially, but that's back open, and ambulances and cars can enter the hospital that way. Roberta Rudolph has lived on Delafield for over 30 years and snapped this picture. I saw a big mud river flowing down the street and lots of things floating in it and cars trying to get through and it was just a mess. Keep in mind, patients planning on coming to UPMC St. Margaret Hospital for an outpatient appointment may still get a call that their appointment is delayed or rescheduled because of all of this flooding. Of course, we don't know when this water will recede. Of course, more rain in the forecast. We will let you know, keep you updated, keep it here on KDKA as well as on our online and on our social media accounts. For now, we are live in the city of Pittsburgh near the Aspenwall border. Amy Wattis, KDKA News.